Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to show you how you can live stream in 720p even when you have very poor internet connection. Yet, instead of downgrading to 240p or 360p or 480p, I will show you in vMix the settings you can apply to be able to live stream in 720p using poor internet connection like 2 mbps and the streaming will be very smooth let's go so so this is vmix now before you start streaming you will need to test your internet upload speed very important so you go to speedtest.net speedtest.net you click on this icon that shows go you click it then you give it like few seconds to check your internet upload speed. So it's checking the download speed. So my internet download speed right now is at 9 Mbps. 9 Mbps. 9 Mbps. While my upload speed, my upload speed is showing 7 Mbps, megabit per second, 7 Mbps, yes. Now, in live streaming, what we use to live stream is the upload speed, not the download speed. Not the download speed, we use upload speed. As a matter of fact, live streaming means that you are uploading video from your system to the internet. So that is live streaming. So is the upload speed that we are using. Now back to vMix. So this is the vMix. Now, as you can see, we are in the vMix environment and here is the streaming. If you click on this icon that says stream, on this menu that says stream, it will start streaming to the destination you have applied. So, but before you start streaming, before you click on stream, you need to click on the streaming settings, configuration streaming settings. So you click on this cog, this dialog box will pop out. This dialog box will show. This dialog box will show. Yes, so this dialog box will show. Now, what we, uh, there are, presets streaming quality presets so let's say there is this um 723.5 mbps so instead of selecting because as a matter of fact if you want to live stream in 720p using poor internet network it will not go it will be lagging it will be the, the streaming will not be smooth it will be jacking it will be jumping and it will not be so smooth and people will leave your, your live streaming. So you are, you are, your next alternative is to downgrade to 240p or to 360p or to 480p. But in this video, I want to show you how you can live stream in 720p with poor internet upload speed. Now, so let's just select this 720p, 3.5 megabits per second. Now, before we, we click on save and close, we need to edit this particular video quality setting. So we click on this cog again. Now, so this will come out. But before then, let me bring out, let me bring out the, the settings. I did it as I designed it as an image so let me bring it in yes yeah, so we go back to the configuration settings we have 723.5 mbps we click on this cog now this dialog box will show this dialog box will show yes so remember that what we have is 2 mbps 2 mbps is what we are working with is is poor it, it, two mbps cannot live stream 720p with the normal settings it will not go it will not be smooth so instead of this 
3,500 video bit rates. That is 3.5 Mbps. So we'll change it to 2,000. We'll change it to 2,000. Then the encode size remains 1280 by 720. Audio bit rate remains 128. 128. So now, in your profile, like you can see here, instead of baseline, make it high. Level, instead of 3.1, make it 5, 5.1. Preset, instead of very fast, make it slower. Then threads, instead of four, make it 12. Instead of four, make it 12 threads. Then your network buffer, instead of 20 seconds, make your network buffer 60 seconds. 60 seconds. 60 seconds. Yes. Now, with, with these settings you are seeing now, uh, you will be able to still live stream in 720p with 2 Mbps and it will go very smooth. Try it and thank me later. Yes, yeah, so we save, then we save and close. Now, when you click stream, you'll be able to live stream using two Mbps. You will live stream in 720p instead of downgrading to 240p to 360p or to 480p. You'll be able to live stream in 720p using two Mbps upload internet speed. Thank you so much for watching this small vMix trick. I'll be bringing you tutorials on vMix, how you can master uh, tricks, how can you can master settings on vMix and be able to live stream your events, your church events, your personal events. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe to my YouTube channel like this video, comment, ask me questions. If you want me to do any tutorial, any, any VMix tutorial, ask me in the comment section. I'll be glad to bring you the tutorial on that particular issue you are having in VMix. Thank you for watching my video today. I will see you on my next video. Thank you.